Hello, my name is Jamie, and I am proud to be a teacher in Widefield School District 3. I'm here to tell you how our district narrowed its focus on student achievement to maximize student learning for every child in every classroom, every day. For many years, Widefield was known as a sturdy little school district on the city's southeast side. Teachers worked hard every day. However, after careful study of student learning data, we felt achievement results were not indicative of teachers' hard work. Our teachers were doing chopped bits of work scattered about the ocean rather than swimming together in the same direction with a common purpose like a school of fish. In addition, evolving and more stringent federal and state mandates such as NCLB and AYP meant accreditation was becoming more and more linked to student achievement. So, in the fall of 2010, Widefield decided to change its direction of student achievement and, therefore, its culture. We contacted Dr. Dave Benson. He understood the characteristics of effective districts and schools, and he compiled a wealth of research-based instructional practices to back him up. In studying our school district, Dr. Benson helped us identify barriers to student achievement, the root causes involved, and assisted in writing our unified improvement plan which would change patterns of student learning and our course of achievement. We were on our way. Our Board of Education and CDE approved our plan, and for the first time in wide field history, our board set four dynamic goals related directly to student achievement. We had charted our course. August 3rd, 2011 was one of the most exciting and impactful days in Widefield School District 3 history. In the Mesa Ridge High School cafeteria, Dr. Benson introduced our Teaching and Learning Cycle foundational work to 120 teachers and administrators with representative teams from every building. I was there, and you could feel the district shifting its focus from what we were teaching to what students would be learning. We were ready for implementation. Our work continued throughout the 2011-2012 school year with the task force of teachers from each school working together to develop our teaching and learning cycle and instructional and assessment frameworks and administrators develop the leadership framework. These are living documents that contain the guts of what our school district is now about, student learning. The teaching and learning cycle and instructional and assessment frameworks are how we do business in Widefield. Our teachers and administrators embrace and live those documents to the point that when they are asked, what is Widefield's educational philosophy? Every one of them can, without hesitation, speak about our mission with great knowledge, depth, and passion. Our leadership team constantly reminded us, this is not about something the ad building is doing. We are the district. We, all of us, are the leaders. This is our work. We have done this together. And moving forward together, we will continue this work. We have to. We owe it to our students, families, and our entire community. Student learning is and always will be our focus. I am proud to be part of a school district that took a step back, realized it needed to change its culture, and then did the work to make that happen. Thank you and welcome to Widefield.